hello and welcome myself rehan ali and today in this tutorial we are gonna write our code for printing these triangle patterns such as solid right triangle hollow right triangle and hollow right triangle with lines oh right, so let's get started first we'll write our code to print this solid triangle before going ahead please watch the previous tutorial for printing left sided triangles as this pattern is the next step of the left sided pattern you can find the link above and also in the description of this video so now i assume that you are able to print this pattern this is nothing but our left sided solid triangle that we draw in our previous tutorial as like here in this pattern also we are printing stars in each row as for row well 1 print 1 star means inner loop will run only once for row well 1 when row well is 2 print 2 times stars as you can see here also for row well 3 print 3 stars and so on so we can use our previous code to print this part we just need to find some way to print these white spaces in front of our previous pattern so for this purpose we can use one another for loop here to print these white spaces now to understand this problem in better way instead of printing these white spaces here i'll print some symbols here see this output here we are using hash symbol instead of white spaces now we can solve this problem very easily here we have a number of rows as 7 so for first row we have to print 6 hash symbols or we can say 6 white spaces then for the second row we have to print 5 white spaces and for the third row 4 white spaces has to be printed and so on means for printing spaces we can start our second inner loop with row numbers minus 1 because for first row we need 6 white spaces but for the second row we need our inner loop to run num rows minus 2 times means 5 times and also for third row inner loop should run num minus 3 times and so on it means that we have to use some temp variable which will increment by 1 each time like this but here as the row will is also giving us the same value such as 1 for first row and 2 for second row and 3 for third row and so on so instead of using this extra temp variable we can use our row well here as like this so this is how our final inner loop will looks like for printing white spaces let's give it a try so this is our code this for loop is responsible for printing spaces let's run it and yeah we get our solid triangle printed here now we'll see how can we write our code to print the next pattern here this pattern is also similar to this hollow pattern we are just adding some white spaces in front of this pattern so just add this for loop in front of this hollow triangle pattern to get our intended output let's see here this is the code that we written for our previous tutorial we just need to add this extra part here or extra for loop here to make it right sided hollow triangle let's run it and uh, yeah this is our right sided hollow triangle and now let's see our next example here this pattern is also same as this hollow pattern just we need to add these extra horizontal lines here here number of rows are 9 by looking at these values we can see that these lines are printed when the value of row well is odd for example we printing these extra lines when the value of row well is 3 and also for row value 5 and again for row value 7 and so on so we can drive our this condition as like this here we are using modulo operator this is an arithmetic operator that returns the remainder for more on these operators you can find some links in the description of these videos as we know that whenever we divide any number with 2 it will either completely divisible by 2 or partially divisible by 2 when the number is completely divisible by 2 it means that the number is even otherwise the number is odd here we are using that concept only so let's write our code here Alright, so this is the code for printing hollow triangle. We just need to add these extra conditions here. Now run the code. And uh, yeah, we get our hollow triangle pattern with these lines printed here. Congratulations, we did it. We successfully wrote our code to print these patterns. Thanks for the patience. If you like this tutorial, please click on the like button and share it with your friends. Also subscribe the channel and don't forget to press the bell icon to never miss out any incoming videos like this one. And that being said, 
see you in the next video